Well, we're still here celebrating with our Carl as she prepares to leave the loose women panel. Oh, no. uh, of course, we, we couldn't let you go home empty-handed. Yeah, we've got a few surprises lined up oh, for you. Please. Uh, we've arranged a few gifts for you to uh, take back home with Ray and Jake. And fast up, we we know that you've had some great times over the years on the show uh, with with chefs. Yeah. Gina DeCampo. Yeah. 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 Greg Wallace. Yeah. Ooh, the John yeah. Tarot. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Now they've always managed to put a smile on your face, Colleen, with their concoctions, and I'm sure that's what you said they were. <laughs> So we've managed to cook up a little treat for you because, uh, well, we know you've got a sweet tooth. So, Chef, bring it in. I've just eaten it. You're <laughs> <laughs> well, trying to kill me. Okay. You don't want to eat on your own, do you, babe? Right. Uh, why uh, did you, oh, God, it's gorgeous. Uh, why uh, did you get into that? Right. We uh, know that one of your favourite topics, as we said earlier, is talking about sex and embarrassing your children, unlike me, who never likes to talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> and we remember that time that you, uh, that you embarrassed uh, Ray when you told the nation that Ray liked you to dress up in your little sexy nurse's outfit. So, um, <laughs> is there a doctor in the house, please? Oh, my God. <laughs> Take a seat next to me. Take a seat next to me, please. Now, he's not gonna give you an internal, so don't get too excited. <laughs> right. But we thought that we thought that we'd give you something which is maybe a little bit more appropriate to your um advancing years, Colleen, if you'd like to just have have a little look in there. Stand up and show. <laughs> a whole length. <laughs> Jesus. Cole, you look, look at that. It's quite matronly, isn't it? It's not being funny. You don't know my Ray. That'll still do it for us. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Jake. You look like something from Little House on the Prairie. Oh. Do you, want to keep, do you want to take the doctor with you or should we yes. send him home? Well, I'd like to send him home to my home. Right. Yeah. <laughs> okay, lovely. 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 We'll See get you later. train tickets. See you later. Thank you, sir. Fantastic. I love that. Um, Thank you, sir. So, Colleen. Oh, stop. I can't bear it. Go on. We're, me, we just want to say that you will be very missed on the show. Not just by us, but by everybody, won't you? Yeah. So... One of the ways that you're never, ever going to be missed, because we think you're a star. Oh, yeah. And we, it's true. And so, we've named a star after you. Oh, my God. And here it is. Here's your little plaque. Oh, there you God. are. The Colleen Nova Colin, star. And it says here, it says here. Um, <laughs> it, I pass that over to her. So, so you, now you can show everybody your little star while I tell you what you are. Your, um, oh, your, it's word. named Colleen Nova, and it's currently residing in Sagitta Globula. <laughs> <laughs> Cluster. Oh, now, we've got a little picture, a picture of that picture. planet of Sagitta Globula. It's life by satellite. It's it's joining us. <laughs> and the globula is sort of rounded. <laughs> That's your star. <laughs> and, um, and, so, and it's on the M71, it I mean, says here. Really? 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 It's a star, so yes, everybody will star. always look up and go, there's oh, Colleen Nova. Hooray! Now, that's not oh. all, because over the years there have been countless oh. classic Colleen moments, uh, both of uh, comedy and the clang of variety. And, um, well, we've had to wade through ten years of footage, but oh, we gosh. could not let you go without showing you just some oh, no, of your best bits. Could you please give a very warm welcome to Colleen Nolan. Colleen's first appearance on Loose Women wasn't as a panellist, but as a guest. I do watch the show at home. And I you... feel like I'm having a girly chat every day around the kitchen table. And after becoming a bona fide loose woman, those girly chats became a regular feature and the audience really got to know the real Colleen. Chocolate. 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 Ooh, why? Bags. 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 Yeah. Painkillers. Who is it? Colleen. Well done, audience. <laughs> 
Over the years, we've all followed the Ray and Colleen love story. You will be my wife by the end of 2008. Lots of love, Ray. Oh! <laughs> genuine. <laughs> genuine. 2008. That's it. <laughs> Someone that wants me, you <laughs> Mrs. Fensom, yeah. over to you. <laughs> oh, you did, did it. I did it! But becoming a newlywed didn't stop her from embarrassing her kids and talking about a sex tape. I did. Oh, and dear. I watched it back immediately. And we looked like two lion seals that needed to be clubbed. <laughs> oh, boys, face it, your mother likes to talk about sex. You know, me and Ray have still got a great sex class. That sex is in there, 105 oh. calories for half an hour. <laughs> oh, oh, my God, Ray will be so excited. I know. <laughs> but it's not just Ray that gets it. I love men's company anyway. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> so which one of boys on would you most like to run off with? I absolutely love snobbing. But that's our Colleen, very upfront. They are quite heavy to carry around, so it's always best to get someone else to carry them around for you. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to put my head between them. Check it out. So, Colleen, from all of us, thanks for all the laughs. Oh, my God, I can't believe she said that. I like her. You suck her. Cock. me and Shane absolutely argued over was the kids, and that's because he didn't want them and neither did I. Sarcastic sense of humour. Thank you very, very much. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> <Lovely. laughs> Thank you so much. I just want to say thank you to everybody, obviously all you girls, who I know will be friends forever, so it's not Absolutely. goodbye for us. But all the people involved with the show backstage, Steve and Emily, our editors, our director, Anthony, who looks after us all the time, even when we're not here, he looks <laughs> after us. Billy, Carl, a warm-up guy, Will, floor manager, just just everybody, Joe and all of the, the gang backstage, all the camera guys. And um, But more importantly, I want to thank you, the audience, and you at home, because you've been through my life with me for 11 years, and you've stood by me, and um, you've made me what I am today. And to my family, you know, the boys and Ray and Kira and, and my sisters and everything, you know, I apologise. Um, <laughs> but I'm not going to stop. And um, so, just thank you to all of you, and I will never forget this show. It's been my life. It will always be my life, and I'll always be grateful to it. Will and, you still um, stand in for me if I'm still at a nightclub? No. <laughs> <laughs> no, if I am here, it's because she's out somewhere. But, uh, <laughs> no, but I just want to say thank you to all of you, and I really, from the bottom of my, my heart, as mushy as this sounds, and I'll probably get slagged for it in the papers for being mushy, but I do really mean it. I love every one of you and all of you at home, so thank you. <laughs>
Quite simply, just miss you. Thank you really you. will. And I, I can't say any more than that. You, you mean so much to all of us and so much to so many of you at home. So um, we're going to take a break. We're going to be back with more surprises for Colleen. No, but for now, <laughs> <laughs> guess what? We've dug up one of, our, one of the guys, first guys that ever fell in love with you, Brian Connolly. Oh. He's going to come out here and cause major embarrassment to you. <laughs> um, <laughs> it's Lucy Women. We're live. We're saying goodbye to Colleen Nolan. We're back in three. Yeah.